Summer may be here, but fall is just around the corner. Yeah, and if you have kids that are wanting to play fall sports, those deadlines are rapidly approaching. Today we're joined by Bailey and Kaylee with the Greater Omaha YMCA to talk about opportunities your family can take part in. Good morning. Thank you for being here with us this morning. Good morning. Good morning. All righty. We have some upcoming fall sports. What sports do we have coming up? So in the fall, we have fall soccer, volleyball, and flag football. Ooh, nice. <laughs> I know. And so do they fill, like, do they fill up pretty quick then? Um, so our registration, once it opens, mm -hmm. it is open. So we have like an early bird section that runs from this Monday, the 20th through July 4th. And you do save $10 during that time. Um, and then from July 5th through July 25th, we have our regular registration. There's not really a cap at the number of participants we can have, but there is obviously those registration deadlines. Okay. So what are the age restrictions uh, for these programs? So for soccer, um, our soccer program runs from three and four year olds all the way up to 12 year olds. Okay. And then for flag football, it is six U through 12 U. And then volleyball, it's eight, eight U through um, 14. You know, when I was younger, I actually took swim lessons with the YMCA. I was a little guppy, and so I remember that so vividly. But that's a lot of—that's a pretty big thing that parents want to get their kids signed up for. So, yeah. is that uh, one of the big like sports that people want to get their kids in? Yeah, we actually don't consider it with sports because oh, okay. it's so big. So yeah, like separate programs for that. But our swim lesson registration for the next session is open currently. Okay. Um, and the session starts the week of June twenty. Sixth, mm -hmm. um, so here in a couple weeks, and then um, the age ranges for that we start at six months in our baby classes, wow. and then we go all the way up to twelve, and then some of our programs have like teen programs, mm -hmm. but most of the time it's adults after that, um, and most of our locations offer adult classes as well. So. Um, we run everywhere from like six months to 99 years, so it's really cool. <laughs> and awesome. swimming lessons are very important. They're life-saving tools. So what about important. those adaptive, adaptive lessons? The adaptive lessons are for those kiddos that maybe need a little extra help. Um, yeah. You know, they don't do, they're not set up for success in the group classes. So um, we have at our arm breast location, we have our adaptive lessons, um, mm -hmm. and those instructors are specifically trained to work with those kiddos, whether, you know, it is a physical disability or a learning disability or something like that. So um, it is a really cool program that we, you know, we had somebody put together a whole program using our Y lessons to make sure that these kids can succeed in the pool as well. Is this the first year since COVID that you guys have able to, like, was capacity ever an issue, things like that? Like, are we just open and kind of ready to Get the kids out there and have fun? <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. Like, I mean, you know, we're always hiring. So yeah. we'll that there, but, um, so I think like coach volunteer coaches and um, like for us lifeguards and swim instructors. Um, but yeah, we're we're ready for the kids. So do all the locations have pools? Sorry. <laughs> all except we do have a new Buena Vista location okay. at the new South Omaha High School um, that won't have a pool, but all the other ones have one. So, okay, great. Yeah. All right, awesome. thank you so much, Kaylee and Bailey, for being here with us this morning. And again, for more information about the Greater Omaha YMCA, you can visit their website at metroymca.org.